In this video, I want to talk a little bit about the idea of the butterfly effect in chaos theory and how we can see it in the price charts. This is not merely an interesting anecdote, but it has pragmatic power in your perception as a trader. I'm saying that because the butterfly effect poses a counterintuitive situation when we apply it to the price charts. Before apprehending why that's the case, first we need to have a clear picture of what the butterfly effect means in chaos theory. A chaotic system has a few peculiar characteristics. For example, a chaotic system can be formed by the combination of two deterministic systems. This is interesting because the first intuition is that the combination of deterministic systems should produce a deterministic system, but that's not the case. The other peculiar characteristic is that chaotic systems are very sensitive to the initial conditions. In other words, very small variations in the initial state of a chaotic system will produce vastly different effects later on. This is the famous butterfly effect that is usually explained in the following sentence. A butterfly flapping its wings in Brazil will cause a hurricane in Texas. The best way of visualizing these two characteristics of chaotic systems is by observing the double pendulum, which is nothing more than two pendulums connected together. A single pendulum is a deterministic system but a double pendulum is a chaotic system. Remember that a combination of two deterministic systems will produce a chaotic motion. To illustrate this better, I'll show you a video that contains 12 double pendulums with slightly different initial conditions. You'll be able to see how the small variation in the initial position produces massive differences in motion later on. Take a look. Hopefully you were able to apprehend the general idea in there. What does this have to do with trading? It has absolutely everything to do with it because markets are chaotic systems. And contrary to common belief, small events in price can produce massive events later on, just like the butterfly will produce a hurricane, metaphorically speaking, of course. This relates to a common experience in trading where you have a good trading context, but you fail to trust a signal to enter a trade because it seems to be insignificant. You do that by comparing the volatility of the signal with the volatility of the recent market. The initial impression is that the signal is too small to be trusted, and with good reason because we need to learn how to filter out the noise of the market. However, a small and apparently insignificant signal in the right context can have devastating effects later on. For example, if you see a fractal bar or a hybrid bar with low volatility in the right context, there is the potential that this bar will produce a trade later on that is hundreds or even thousands of pips in length. But it all starts at the apparently insignificant focal point. Weirdly enough, this is something that happens quite frequently. For some reason, traders always expect some sort of flashy event when an opportunity presents itself in the market, but that usually doesn't happen, otherwise it would be too obvious. The good opportunities hide and they have this capacity of misleading everybody by being unimpressive in the first moment. If you have some experience with charts, I'm sure you will relate to what I'm talking about. If you have no idea what I'm on about, soak the advice and try to look for charts where massively profitable opportunities were preceded by small events that sneak in the candlestick forest. I hope this video was helpful for you in some way. If you want to learn more about professional trading, check out the courses on the video description. There's the Fractal Flow series, which serve as a great foundational work. And then we have the flagship price section course that will elevate your trading to the next level. If you wish to support the channel, please click the like button, subscribe to the channel, and leave your comments below. Thank you for watching, and I hope to see you in the next video. Take care.